Hi, first graders. Um, during the school year, we did read uh, some little books about maps, either in small group or as a class. So I don't know if you have this article. It's called Learn About Maps. If you do have it, you are welcome to read it and answer the questions. Um, I also sent home this little book of map skills right when all of this happened. So, and it's small, so I assume maybe some lost it. And if you did, that's okay. But if you didn't and you wanna do it, you can. So for the first page, it says color land green and color the water blue. This is a blank. So this is a globe. So you'll fill in the word globe. Directions. So I don't know if you remember this, but we talked about never eat sour worms or never eat slimy worms. And some of you guys made up your own sayings. So you would put an N here for north, an E for east, S for south, and a W for west. Map symbols. So if you were to create a map, you get to make up symbols here for what um, things would mean. So for example, if you did a picture of a tree, that could represent the forest. If you did a picture of a picnic table, that could represent a park. A classroom map, you're welcome to draw a picture of our classroom, if, what it would look like if you were like a bird driving over it or flying over it. A community map, so this would be like the community you live in. Um, so you draw a picture of your neighborhood. If you were a bird flying over it, what would it look like if you were looking down? And then the last page is a picture of the United States. So we live in Oregon, which is right here. So you would color Oregon blue. So this is an optional map assignment if you would like to do it.